Okay, you'll see some footage that I cut of the um, yurt raising number two, the trial one. We're, we've done another trial to set it up to get all the measurements so that I can build a wood floor for it. Um, this, um, we didn't film a lot of the stuff that happened today of getting the roof and that on because it was just way too much work. Uh, but we learnt a lot. Anyway, it's up. And I'll cut in as much footage as I can. But there it is. Uh, very tricky to get the uh, the roof up. Um, and then today the wrap, the the wrap that goes around the side was very easy. One piece, you just unrolled it. Um, getting the roof silk on wasn't too bad when we got a third pair of hands and we just roped it and pulled it up and over and then we did the same thing with the campers outer but that was a lot of mucking around to um, line up the door and then it doesn't actually line up correctly so uh, hence we have a bit of a tarp just to cover that because there's a gap of the inner liner and you can see over here there's another gap there um, and that's because the walls are not quite the right thing what was essential is to actually make sure these lattice work walls hopefully the light in here is okay but you've got to make certain that these walls are exactly the right diameter now this one's approximately the right height but this one here is much lower and you can see the drop uh, in the roof there it's like a good kind of 50 mil, 100 mil, 5 centimeters, 10 centimeters, maybe an inch or two lower. This panel is lower, which has caused the roof to be on a bit of a slant. <coughs> so you can see that part is high, and that part is rock solid. Could, you could take your weight on those. This side has a bit of spring to it, and I think it's because that wall is lower. So next time we do it, we'll make sure that all the walls are exactly the right height. We'll make sure that this is exactly level. And we'll make sure that the center disc is level as well before we put the roof together. Um, but this roof is actually one piece. It's a, got a satin inner lining, felt outer lining, and it's in one piece. So that's why we had to rope it and pull it over. And then same with the canvas.